of what we're dealing with. Ooh, it's a train. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. Well, this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clint, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, huh? Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. <laughs> yeah, the most dangerous thing. Me. <laughs> Alright, let's open this. been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so, but this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Yeah, it'd be nice to know. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. I'll take this to Kanja for Doc. Is that this way? Yep. Don't want to hold that little mess. Derailed. Only half of it. Would you find? you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Have you, you uh, with us happy time. you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods, just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Alright, I'm not even, I'm not gonna push, uh, that question onto you. Doo, 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 doo. Here you go. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. And well, I let him get stung I by a bee, see the results. You're probably right. found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Right, nice. There you go. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Duck feels good. Yeah, me neither. I don't think it's stuck we gotta worry about. Victor and a walker to jump out of one of these. Um, 
I like that one. I don't think I can take multiples, can I? No, let's take that one because it don't really need the other two. So that's clear of zombies. Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. If he's even alive. Undead. Phew. Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. Entire face was caved in. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. Ask Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, <laughs> let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Uh, take the map. Bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. Alright. Hey, Kent. What's up? Uh, you want to talk about Duck? I don't know about leaving Lily back there. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys, we can figure it out. I don't know about leaving Lily back there. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Don't worry about it. We just would have had to deal with her eventually. Uh, you want to talk about Duck? I'm really sorry, Kitty. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. And we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys, we can figure it out. I'll get back to it. Me too. I have no idea what to do with these. Yeah, stop pushing shit. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Animal crackers, I want. This door's gonna hurt. Oh, I see your ideal. Okay. You aren't gonna like this. Bang. One more for good luck. Aww. Animal cracking. No fun. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. I got a 
box of edible crackers. Anyone here want animal crackers? Anyone at all want some animal crackers? Here, we found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you, that's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. <laughs> Thank you, Lee. Sure. Yeah, it wasn't fussy at all, cannibalism. <laughs> on this side. There we go. It's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. Okay, so how are we gonna break it loose? It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. There's got to be a better way to do this. <laughs> Shit. Broken. Not broken on the other side. Derailed. I need a bunch of force. How much is a bunch of force? If one don't work, try more. And if all don't work, well... It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Can we get the train moving? Snap it somehow? Is there anything hidden? Anything at all? Nope. And we'll say that that one's weapon tray. That one's empty. That one's empty. I have no idea what to do with these. Oh, here we go. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Okay. Ooh. 
I got an idea. Come on, make it quick. Goddamn camera angles, hey. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. <laughs> we'll see about that. In the RV, I go. Pencil next to the peanut butter. Right. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. So we need six, uh, down, down, up, 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 down, up. Alright, where is six? Six. Ah, oh, fuck. Down, down, up. Up. Um. Now I go to my notepad. Uh. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Alright. Up, down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did lit the dash up! So far, so good. Alright. Now. Yeah. No board. Five. Alpha twist, full twist. Alpha twist. Now we're talking. Yeah, I need nine, which I'm guessing. Is this? Green light. Power is on. Holy shit! We're golden! <laughs> yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, it feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. I doubt it. It's all yours. All right. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Will do. There, 
Hey, Kenny, we're loose. You touch any of my stuff? Yeah, no, not yet. for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. <laughs> You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. <laughs> ah, Chuck. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Get <laughs> caught red-handed. Okay, man. Keep him alive. I can respect it. Bad. I like it. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. I mean, it was he's trained to begin with. I can respect it. Oh, and you know you how to play guitar. Yeah, welcome to the back. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Alright, everybody. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. <laughs> Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Oh, God. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Reality hits in quick. Uh, we can't know this. Is the train ready to go? Is the train really a good idea with Duck like that? Maybe we should focus on one thing at a time. Yes. What can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. That boy is going to eat the only doctor we have. Punch it. A full solid five kilometers an hour. Even though that thing can still crush a fucking cow at that speed. <laughs> There's a horde of zombies in front of us, don't worry, you can gun it down and then just fucking whack it in reverse. <laughs> hey mate, I would say give us a wave, but you're missing the arm. Yeah, 
Yep, the dog is as good as fucked. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. Eh. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What, sir? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Yep, I'm on it. Thank you. Could you just get If you take a finger, face? make sure it ain't the rude one. I still need that one. <laughs> you leave me the rude finger and the thumb, I'm happy. We need to stop this train. Okay. If I still got me farm, I can still hold a gun. If I still got the root finger, I can still pull the trigger. <laughs> Just means I'm flipping everyone off as I shoot. You need to stop the train. That's a direct order, sir. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Oh, that would be your son's blood. Yeah, your, your son's, son's blood. blood. Get out of here, man. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. He won't be... Wait, I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. So the train this isn't about Doug. This isn't about Doug. The hell it's not. You think we're pals and you know me? You're some elitist prick with a fancy education who could pick me apart? It's not like that. The fuck it isn't. Uh, you could say... You couldn't save Herschel's son then, and you can't save Duck now. Shut your mouth! So He's gonna run in like a coward. Yeah, well deserved. Uh, yep, come on. Leave me the fuck alone! I don't need you, and Duck doesn't need you! Fun fact, I can be a good punching bag. But when I hit back, I hit back twice as hard. <laughs> I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. You don't even have a child! You don't know what this is like, you fucker! You're not helping my family! You're not helping Clementine! You're not helping anybody! And now it's my turn. <laughs> I've had your back. Don't make me fucking regret it. Look, maybe we take this turn by turn. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Always been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Uh, take as long, take as, you as, need. long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. 
There's always time to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. No ifs, no buts, There's... no coconuts. Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. We can just drift off to sleep. Right, hun? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do, I'll it. do it. No. It should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. should take out their own kid. Two minutes later. Damn things a bit. <laughs> What's happening? There's only a nipple on his leg, bang. He got bit on the arm, get the hacksaw. <laughs> um, I think everything's fine. Nothing. Everything is fine. No, it's not. Oh, well, you clued on very quick. What are you doing? Um, I'm gonna to make sure he's okay. I'm gonna kill him. I'm killing him. Eh, you happy? For good? Yes, so he doesn't come back. <laughs> you clued on, so... Things are... What the... No! Ben. Take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Got a bad feeling about this. Ah, goddamn it. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Domed herself in front of the kid. Why, cat? Honey. Oh, fucking god. <laughs> uh, still have... Oh, my god. Yep. I. I. Give me the gun. Me the gun kid. I'll do it. I don't want you to be you. You lost one. You ain't losing the other. Not by your hands. Oh god damn it, you watched anyway. <laughs>
Kanto? Uh-uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What are you thinking about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? Swear. <laughs> Sorry. I would have took some sense into it. Don't be mad. Hey. How you doing? What you said to me, I don't. Don't talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Excuse me, son. I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? Damn it. I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah. And then what? And we find a boat. We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Like a gun. Are you kidding me? What? She's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. Not anymore. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plant, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Uh, uh, Where are you yeah. headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Uh, you you have family? any family? Out there somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past oh, 14 years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Uh, I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. You're <laughs> homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and well, they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. <laughs> Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. Damn, if I find a drink, I'll find <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe get him a drink as well. Hey, man. You and me, we... Uh, oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. Are there any maps in here? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. And there's a map. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Yeah, sure. Ah. Hey, what up? Hey, Ben. Hey. Charlie didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Many, many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. I don't know if we can count on Kennedy. Yeah. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. I accidentally said There's Kennedy. Not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah. We cannot count on not. Kennedy. <laughs> See you. 
Yeah. Oh, the busiest drink. Take that. I hope we're not on this train much longer. It's a fifth of whiskey. <laughs> a fifth? Um, let's see. They look clean enough. Alright, you. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh. He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. And we need to protect yourself. Alright. Gun you pushed. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Uh, aim for the head, squint the target. Squeeze the trigger. Steadily, okay? Don't give it a quick yank or pull. Steady. I can do that. Every time. It'll be tough, but just remember to do that. You'll hit what you're aiming at. Okay. I'm ready. Also, shooting on an exhale. <laughs> Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yep. Yeah, you do. Uh, keep it steady. Aim right, aim left. Keep it steady. steady Got it. Aim high up. Okay, a little higher. I got it. Finger. Excellent. Good shot. Careful not to shoot up his house. So left. Okay. Aim a little bit more to the left. Aim a little higher. There you go. Nice. See that first bullet? Oh, clean. I did it. Yeah, you did. Good job. I squeezed the trigger, just like you said. I know. You did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. <laughs> Careful how you're handing that back now. <laughs> Alright. Here go. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. 
I got the I can do this now. I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. Do you know how to do this? Eh, uh, yeah, yeah, of course. Of course. I don't believe you. Well, good. Good? Means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. This is true. Uh, no, it's different. Killing means bad, no matter what. No, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Who the whiskey going to first? Not you. I don't know why it went to you first. <laughs> Just me, man, you're gonna wanna switch. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Uh, sure. Sure. You shared a drink with Chuck. Ooh. Not known for its finish. No kidding. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Yeah, I got some in mind. Chuck, Chuck wants to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. There you go. Drink. Thanks. Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. Oh, what? Yeah. yeah you, you're too fucking young, Brokel. It was me. Huh? I, knew it. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. Why wouldn't you do it? Uh... Jesus, Ben. I know. They said they had my friend. That he was with just, them. Just stop. Fuck. Can we even trust you? Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just... No. Just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. I mean, think about it, mate. If Kenny found out, you're dead.
Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. Good for the time being. Um, we should look for your parents. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay. And, well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. I think I heard them die. They're not dead. Do you want them to be? Don't be ridiculous. I don't want you to get hurt any more than you have. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Tell them what? <laughs> um. Clem, come on. That's not a good idea. You can't tell me what to do. Clementine. I don't want to talk about it anymore. All right. How do you feel? <laughs> good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh shit! Hold on everybody! <laughs> 